It's been three years of hell for Mr. Martindale and Livingston. However, he says if he can climb out of purgatory, aka the relegation zone, then it will be the biggest achievement of his managerial career. Welcome back, guys, to Fog Football. And David Martindale, a big character in Scottish football, but unfortunately, he is also in big trouble. He is the manager of Livingston. They've got no money. They've got no fans. A lot of people would argue they've got no chance of staying in the Scottish top flight for next season. However, I have defended at Livingston. I have said that I believe they could catch Ross County. And recent results have shown, I think, especially from a county side, that they aren't that good either. So I think Livingston have a chance, albeit a small chance. They have Livingston up next. That's going to be a pretty much must-win game, or at least a game they definitely cannot afford to lose. However, before that, Martindale has opened up about the current ongoing situation at Livingston with an interview on BBC Sport. This is what Martindale had to say regarding the club, the position it's in, and the money it is losing. Quote, Half a million pounds it's cost over the last three years. That budget coming away from the football department through litigation has made the job extremely hard. The club would be in a far better place if it wasn't for outside parties blocking everything the current regime is trying to do. It's been three years of hell, dealing with a lot of adversity in the building, dealing with lawyers, emails. I am fortunately or unfortunately the main constant at the club. I have been here for 10 years. I've known 99% of the background, so they have relied on me to help the club through that difficult moment. There's been some dark moments, and I would like to be honest with the media, but I'm fairly resilient. I am used to adversity. Probably half an hour later, I'm sitting with my staff saying, let's go again. We are under no illusion about how big a game it is against Ross County, probably the most significant period of my managerial or coaching career. If I can keep Livingston in the Premiership, it is the biggest achievement I've had at the club, and that includes winning League One and getting promoted from the Championship and getting to a Cup Final. I think it was very, I think I was very focal at the start of the season, speaking about how difficult a season it was going to be. Granted, I didn't think it was going to be this difficult. It would be a monumental achievement for the players and staff and the club, not me, everybody collectively. End of quote. So Martindale here, pretty much, he thinks that Livingston are up against it. He thinks it's mission impossible. He may as well name himself Tom Cruise for the rest of the season. Because he, he's holding on to whatever hope he has left. But he's admitting that it's going to be tough. And if he can somehow do it, then it would be the biggest achievement that he has accomplished in his career. And you know what? I'd like to see Martindale do it. He's a good guy. He's a funny guy. I think he's good for Scottish football. I like Martindale. I like his interviews. I like his take on life. And I want to see Martindale remain in the Premiership. I want Ross County to go down. No offence, Ross County fans, but your team's been shite for a while now. You've hired unlikable wankers after unlikable wankers. Here, first you've got Malky Mackay, uh, then you have that fruit that came from Peterborough or Morecambe or whatever shite team in League 2 he came from, Derek Adams. Screw him. Screw Ross County. I hope County go down. I hope Livingston stay up. And I think David Martindale can do it. Massive game at the weekend. For me, obviously, it's not the biggest game. There's some really big games at the weekend, but it's a massive game, no doubt about it. In terms of who's going to be relegated this season, that game could decide that. So I'm looking forward to it. I'll catch you guys in the next one. But David Martindale, if he can do it, I probably agree with him. If he can keep them up, this would probably be the biggest achievement he's had because a few weeks ago, it looked down and out. But now, again, Livingston... I've got a, bit, a little bit of oxygen, they're, they're breathing, but can they keep that breath alive? We'll find out. Ross County, Livy at the weekend, going to be a massive game. I hope Livy can do it. Let me know what you think down below and I'll catch you in the next one, guys. Till then, peace.